What's going on, YouTube? How y'all doing out there, man? It's your boy Tank again, and I, I'm back with a blast from the past, guys. So, um, I, I have a sneaker right here, and man, I, I got this sneaker. Uh, just because uh, it was it was it was something from my childhood, and man, like I really love this shoe, man. When I when I got this sneaker, it caught a lot of eyes. Uh, uh, some people didn't even know what it was. Some people didn't even know this guy had a shoe. But back then, man, like this dude was a dominant uh, player in the NBA. You feel me? But I had this sneaker back when I was uh, in elementary. Uh, back in elementary, I was probably in like the fourth or fifth grade, man, back in 96 or 97. And man, like I remember, man, I actually picked this shoe out when I was when I was a kid, man. Uh, I just remember going to the shoe store. I think, yeah, I remember going to the shoe store with my mom and dad. And I was like, man, like those, I like those. I like those. Can I get those? Can I get them? And man, like they bought them for me, and man, like I just been putting them things on. Man, it's something about putting on a fresh pair of kicks, bro. And like we, I mean, man, it's just snug to your feet, just just right. But with the with this sneaker, uh, uh, with this sneaker, I got it because it was a part of my childhood, and I always wanted it back. And here it is. All right, guys, here we go. Uh, I mean, man, like some of y'all probably already know what this is. Uh, some of y'all don't, but if you don't, just keep watching. I guarantee you, you won't be disappointed. And yeah, uh, let me go ahead and remove my hand. As you guys can see, they do say Reebok, right? All right, so this is a Reebok sneaker. And man, back then, uh, Reebok signed Shaquille O'Neal to a big deal. So on the side right here, it do say Reebok. Um, on the other side, it also has have the Reebok Classic. Um, and they didn't they didn't change this box around. On, on the top of the box, you see you got the the Shaq name with his logo right there with him jamming on somebody. <laughs> but yeah, man, let's go ahead and open these things up. You used to be able to open the lid from the top. But now a lot of these uh, shoe companies are starting to go with the, the slide out. It gives a better presentation for the box itself. The label reads, uh, Shaq Gnosis, unisex, basketball, basketball, made in Vietnamese, Reebok, 10 and a half, personal pair, black, white, silver, metallic. Okay. I'm in the house quarantine, I might as well knock out some bids, right? So, let's go ahead and get into this bad baby. All right, guys, and it do come wrapped in uh, Reebok tissue paper. <laughs> Shit. I want y'all to see this too, all right? I, I don't know what it is, but I just get excited when I'm opening up kicks, man. I love it. All right, here we go. There it is. That's that's my childhood, man. These are like a blast from my past, of course. We have the Shaq Gnosis right here. But so like these released back in 1995, and uh, I, I was able to get them on um, when they did release. So if I had them back then. Like the whole design of this shoe is pretty unique. Um, you see, you got the stripes and everything. Looking at some of the OG kind of uh, versions and. Like on those, but the actual stripes and the sole didn't really match up. So with them uh, retro knees, they made them a lot better. Uh, like they made sure like the, the stripes was lined up to the soles completely. And yeah, I didn't change it again. <laughs> uh, I done went ahead and put on the velvet do-rag and everything. Man, I'm trying to get my waves bro. Well, my waves is right. It's just, I just want them to look better. But anyway, man, like that's neither here nor there. We're here to talk about this. So, 
Uh, so as you guys can see, like this shoe was well put together. Um, um, like they went ahead and put a pull tag on the back of here and it's pretty sturdy, man. And I do like the, the uh, angle support right here. It's, I mean, you got a lot of cushion right there. Um, and in the inside of the shoe, it do say, I mean, it do say Reebok with Shaq symbol right there. I don't know if the camera can pick that up. I hope you guys can see that, man. So the materials that they used on this sneaker was a synthetic suede and leather. The shoe itself is well put together. Yeah, so at the bottom, like they also went ahead and put the honeycombs in there. And like this, this is the same, this is the same kind of materials that they use for, uh, for Ally Iverson shoe, um, to be exact. So you got one right here and then you also got one right here. So the colors are black, white, and metallic. And like they have the, the Reebok symbol in metallic and then they also have the Shaq symbol right there in metallic. So after doing some research on this sneaker, the designer of this shoe, uh, his name was uh, uh, Jonathan Morris, right? So Jonathan Morris was the head designer for Reebok back in the day. Um, I don't know if he still is today. I doubt it. I doubt it very seriously. They brought him in uh, just to uh, design Shaq a shoe. This is what he came up with. So Shaq didn't have any input on this sneaker. He just showed up to a meeting and he was, and, and they was like, hey bro, this is your sneaker. <laughs> and he went with it. So Shaq made this shoe famous. And I think there was another actor that also made this shoe famous. He actually debuted in one of his movies. And that actor is uh, Will Smith, right here. So Will Smith debuted this sneaker in Man in Black. Shaq also showed this sneaker uh, on and off the court as well. Shaq showed this shoe in uh, MTV Cribs when they was interviewing him and, and, and he was showing off his big old house and, and, and all his other stuff. And here's a picture of that right there. But man, all in all, I had this sneaker when I was younger. I wanted it again once I uh, knew that Reebok was gonna re-release these. This shoe is a love it or hate it kind of shoe. Either you love it or you hate it. I will be rocking these. I don't know when, but I will be rocking these. And these are definitely a head turner shoe, man. Uh, you can be, you can have these on walking in a sneaker event. People is gonna turn around and look at what's on your feet, and you gonna have these on. Yeah, guys, man, like this shoe is fire, man. So if y'all looking for this sneaker right here, y'all can probably go on StockX or GOAT and probably get it for no more than 170, okay? All right, guys, man, I gotta get ready to hit the, I gotta get ready to hit the road. And I mean, hope I'm gonna get ready to go to the mall and check some things out. Um, I'm trying to get ready for tomorrow's big release of the Jordan 13 Flints. I've gotta make sure I'm able to cop all my pairs, especially for the customers that shop with me. I just wanna be able to make sure I get all them. I don't even have my own pair secured, you know what I mean? So I just wanna take care of everybody that shop with your boy. And that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna be ready to go up there and, and uh, check out all my connects. Uh, I mean, rub some elbows and probably grease some palms, man. <laughs> you feel me? But, all right, guys, man, this is your boy Tank. And uh, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. And uh, also go ahead and follow me on IG at Tank underscore Closet23. And, man, you know, man, just go ahead and leave a comment too, man. We can talk, we can chill. I do reply back to everybody that that leave comments. I mean, like, that's just me. You guys take the time out y'all day to, to write a comment or, I mean, just even watch my videos. I'm gonna go ahead and take that time out of my day and answer your comment or I mean just chop it up with you. Same thing on uh, IG. Man, you hit me up on IG and we're gonna chop it up. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's just me, man. I really appreciate y'all coming out, uh, checking your boy Tank out, and I can't leave without saying we all got dreams. All our dreams can come true, but only if you got the courage to pursue them. This your boy Tank, man. I love y'all, man. I'm out. <laughs>